Hey, everybody. Um, this is for GarageBand users who have gotten frustrated with the process of selecting multiple regions and how long it takes to do so if you want to move a part of your track and you want to move multiple regions at the same time. Uh, I finally came across this trick online and I just wanted to illustrate it for folks because I think this is a useful tip if you don't know about it. So if you have done a bunch of editing and so your tracks are all chopped up into small regions like this, and you want to like insert something there in the middle and you need to move all the regions. If you just move one region, you're going to smash the other regions and you're going to distort your recording, what you've got. So what I've been doing the last year and a half is individually selecting every tiny little slice, every tiny little region of the track in order to um, select the tracks that I need to, to move them. And unless your tracks are big enough. When you ma manually select them, you're at peril of missing a tiny little slice. So you have to do that. You have to go through it manually, and then you can drag the tracks so that you have space there in the middle to add whatever piece you wanted to add. And so I'm just going to illustrate this by adding a tiny little new recorded segment. And so then what I was doing for the last year and a half was going through and again, manually selecting every tiny little slice so that I could move the regions of those two tracks back in place. But now I'm going to show you a much quicker technique. It is selecting the whole dang thing all at once by just clicking and dragging. And maybe you already knew this, <laughs> but if you didn't know that you could do this, now you know you can select multiple regions just by dragging through the whole area. And now you have one highlighted multiple region area that you can move around as much as you want. And there you go. That's the tip. I'm Susie Sherman at Sue's Next Thing on social media, and I host the podcast and The Next Thing You Know, which is found at nextthingpodcast.com.